Hey guys, I just finished prepping all of my food, so I'm going to go through um, everything that I'm eating this week. Most of it is fresh, but I am using a few um, packaged products and whatnot. Um, I like to use a lot of the same recipes too, so I kind of keep things pretty simple, roast a lot of veggies, uh, use a lot of eggs, and do um, either turkey or chicken. So here we go. Here I have steel cut oatmeal with cinnamon and apple chunks, hard boiled eggs, leftover from my chicken salad that I made. Uh, I'll be eating lots of turkey bacon this week. Here's one of the proteins that I use, one of the protein powders I use. Um, I've also been eating gluten free bread which is really yummy. Um, I'll eat that or the Ezekiel raisin bread um, with just great stuff and some jelly that I buy from Sprouts. Um, I'll have either or. I won't have both in one day. I'll have that one or that one. Then I have my egg whites, of course, with spinach and kale. I have my hemp seeds that I throw in my smoothies. I have chicken salad that I made for enough for four days. It's a uh, canned chicken, veganaise, hard-boiled eggs, and ton of veggies, onions, bell peppers, tomatoes, and chili. I also have these low-carb tortillas that I just bought today. Eh, wasn't too crazy about them, so I'm not sure if I'll be eating them too often, but I do put my eggs and turkey bacon in here. Um, of course, avocados for my healthy fats. I have cottage cheese that I eat uh, maybe a couple times a week. I have pinto beans in here uh, made boiled in water, just made from water and salt. And then of course my chocolate shakeology. Um, I eat a lot of coconut oil. Um, I'll put it in my coffee. I will um, put it on my toast. Oh, and I always eat um, at least half a banana a day, so I did buy extra bananas for my stuff. Here I have three ounces of skirt steak or carne asada in each uh, little container. And then I have my roasted veggies. It's asparagus, mushrooms, garlic, and onions all in um, roasted in coconut oil. So I'm going to add that to my steak. Oh, and I almost forgot, I do eat one square of dark chocolate. As for the dark chocolate, I'm going to try to stick to just one um, square per day or per occasion, I guess you could say. Um, I am taking on a cheat-free challenge, um, trying to go at least through the holidays, or at least till Halloween, without um, having any cheat meals or snacks and 86% dark chocolate is one of the things that um, doesn't trigger me to like eat a ton of chocolate at one time like a normal um, candy bar or cookie or brownie would do. So we'll see what happens. Um, wish me luck. I do make other um, foods for my husband. Here's his dinner. It's pasta with um, chicken meatballs and a ton of veggies in pasta sauce cooked and I did cook it in um, olive oil. If you're interested in joining my cheat free challenge or if you want to just kind of check out my recipes and my page please go to strong and sexy with Alex and it's and with the and symbol uh, so strong and sexy with Alex you can find all my stuff on there you can follow me like my page and hopefully hopefully we can connect on Facebook or if you're on Instagram, you can follow me. It's Alex G. Fit Mama. So I'll see you guys soon. Bye.